Hi everyone, welcome back to this channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to block a website without using Google extensions. We're just going to need to use CMD. First, we have to check that we can access the website that we want to block. This is to make sure that what we will do in this video really works. For this tutorial, we will use Facebook as an example. Alright, as we can see, Facebook is still accessible on this computer. So let's try to block Facebook. To do that, we need to open the command prompt as an administrator. Once the CMD is open, we have to go to the etc folder which is a subfolder of the drivers. To do that, we need to type cd drivers slash etc, then press enter. Once you're in the etc folder, we need to open the host's file. We're gonna need a text editor to open and edit this file. You can use any other text editor like Sublime Text or Atom, but in this tutorial, we are gonna use the notepad. So to do that, we can type notepad hosts, then press enter. When the file is open, we can now add the website that we are going to block. In our case, it's Facebook. To do that, we will have to locate the line which has 127.0.0.1 localhost. It's important to find this because we are going to add a text that will enable us to block our website after this line. Once we see it, we're just going to have to type 127.0.0.1 space or tab then the URL of the website that we'd like to block. So I'm going to type in www.facebook.com and then hit save. After saving, we need to close all the windows. Then, we need to open our browser to see if it worked, and let's access Facebook. We shouldn't be able to access it now. So that's it everyone. Thank you for watching and if you liked this video, please don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. This is Johnny and see you in the next one.